What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Teams and in today's video gonna learn how to create a survey into our WordPress website for free in order to collect information to improve our services, to improve our sales process or to know more about our customers, okay? So how to do this for free is what we're gonna learn in today's video. But before I can continue, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video and share this content with a friend of yours. I have no idea how much it helps us because we bring daily videos about WordPress SEO, plugins, optimizations, and many more topics in order to use internets on your site's favor. So let's get this started. First of all, move to our WordPress dashboard, okay? So from the dashboard, you're gonna review the left sidebar of menus, hover our mouse over plugins and click on add new, okay? Into the upper right corner at a field called search plugins, we're gonna type quiz and survey master, okay? So this is the top hated free survey maker wordpress plugin okay so it's good it's working great so i'm gonna start using this one okay so click on install now click on activate button this is gonna redirect you to the plugins list no need to worry whoever now you're gonna be able to see a new button on the wordpress left sidebar of menus and this is the one key sm okay so here is the dashboard, quizzes and surveys, questions, categories, results, settings, tools, titles. So we're going to start into right here, okay? Quizzes and surveys, okay? And we're going to be creating our new survey. So add new. We can choose some templates if you're a pro user, but we're going to keep all for free using the default theme, okay? After this, go to next. Now we need to apply a name. for our quiz, okay, for our, for our survey. And we can choose from this three types, okay? Quizzes, surveys, and simple forms, okay? I would like to create a survey. Enable contact form, no, thank you. Time limit in minutes, no. If you want to have no limits, leave it zero, okay? Require user login, no. Disable first page on quiz, no and enable comments box okay no we do not want comments so let's go to the next and right here we have other very important parts okay for example sync with google sheets paypal and stripe integrations save and resume simple pop-ups we have some add-ons from this plugin okay in the case that i want but i do not want this so low so let's click on create quiz into the bottom right corner. Here is our quiz and we have page one and can create more pages, for example. So let's do what your new question, type your question here. How old are you? We can change description if possible. Type your age in the case that you want to apply some description, okay? Your answer, okay? So, right here, we can, for example, Type the answers, okay? So, 18, 3 questions right here to our survey we can choose from the right side bar now we can choose the question type it can be multiple choices okay
can be text answers, rich answers, or image answers, okay? Let's keep on text answers and save change. What else we can do right here? We can create a new question in the case that we want. Add a question or create a new question. Let's create a new question. Do you have a car? Yes. No. Now we can choose the type of the question, okay? So it is a simple yes or no. So short answer. Let's save the change. So we already have two questions on our form. Of course, we can create more and more questions in the case that you need, but it's already good to start, okay? Now we're gonna move to contact. This is a very important part, okay, because we're gonna be collecting the contact information of this person, so the name, the email, the phone and business, I have no need, so let's save the form. The text. We can select some previously made messages in the case that we prefer. Let's move to options. Quiz type is a survey. Require user login, no. So this is the same settings that I already have created. The emails. Then we're gonna be receiving the results page. We can add some additional conditions in the case that we want. No need for it. The style. Here are the templates that they have, okay? We can apply some custom CSS. And let's publish success. So if I go right here now to quizzes and surveys, I'm gonna be able to see this survey right here and how to place this into my page. Let's open it. Here is the page one. We can create another page in the case that you need. Let me go back to the settings. Right here we have the short code, okay? This little icon. Click on it. Embed short code and link short code. So copy this embed short code. You can move to a page or to a post of your site. Apply the short code. Publish the page or apply in some previously made page. And here is our quiz. We have the name, the email, and the answers, okay? So you can complete the answers in the way that you want. For example, for example, your age and if you have a car or not. After this you can submit. Let's go back to our form. 
in order to complete it better. Let me delete this one. Let me clone this one. Let's create a new page to have more options. You can use a previously created question to, to add another question. So like starting from a template, I will not change this to not lose the time. However, as you can see, we have a couple of options right here. Okay. So let's update. I'll save it. Now let's try to refresh this and try again. Next. Next. So we have our page two. Submit. And here is what we have. So Let's go to the results page once again. As you can see, we did two tests and have two results right here. And you can see the amount of seconds and other settings that you can complete according to the time you have, okay? And your needs. But as you can see, it's really completed. You can create your questions, you can set up other metrics that is important for you or not, okay? You can set correct or incorrect answers and many more options like this okay and that is i hope you guys enjoy your first survey okay in order and happy and be happy while collecting your information to improve your services and many more topics like this and that is i hope you guys enjoyed this video feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question don't forget to check out our borders wordpress plugin in order to gain widgets elements and templates and our enzu wordpress team in order to have pre-built websites that you can import with a single click moreover go to visualmoto.com visit our blog for more templates tools icons and many more tutorials and it is i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you tomorrow all the best